too. Okay, you have to be very relaxed. You are just a little bit too stiff. You have to relax. And now you have to play with the expression of the face and bring the... Yeah, right. Beautiful. This photo shoot is different than any other photo shoot because, like, in this place, like, there was loads of, like, all the public was looking at you because it's such a public type place that we're doing it in. People are staring at you. You're trying to keep a serious face and all the girls are, like, looking at you now. It's really good fun and he's real nice and tells you exactly what to do. Another one. Whoever. Bonjour. Ça va? It's... Ton nom, c'est... Your name is... Sarah. Sarah, Sarah. But it's Sarah, Sarah. Je savais que Sarah. I am loving all the makeup and the hair. Um, the dress is by Lanvin or Lanvin. And uh, the shoes are gorgeous. It's just brilliant fun to get all dolled up and to do a photo shoot like that instead of all the natural ones that we've been doing. Now turn the other side. Yeah. yeah. Love it. I think I feel very French. <laughs> Ooh la la. <laughs> Ashling is relaxed throughout her shoot enjoying both the location and her glamorous transformation. I have confidence, but I don't think I'm overconfident or anything like that as in cocky, kind of cross the border. Age has a lot to do with confidence in this competition, being a little bit older than the girls. You have, you have little advantages naturally, you know, you able, maybe a little bit better communication skills. You've lived life longer, you have more life experience, so obviously there's going to be that little bit extra to the people that are older. Great, Ashling. That's it. Jenny arrives in time for the group shot. She wants to see how the girls handle working together as models. Four girls together, which is the most difficult for them because, of course, they have to be by their own and also take care of the others. And so it's always the most difficult part to work together. In this business, everybody is supposed to be very friendly. <laughs> There's always one model that becomes the center of the shooting for one reason or another. And it's very interesting to see how they work with each other because it takes time for the photographer to direct everyone. It's a lot of work for a photographer, it's a lot of work for a model. Very close now, very, very close. Yes, right. I prefer to work on my own because you're taking straight direction and there's no one else to take up time. I know it doesn't sound great, but it's the direction is totally focused on you and the photographer's looking for your best, not the group's best. So I suppose I'd prefer my single shots on my own. Oh! To tell you the truth, I'm very surprised first about the level of, the, of those competitors. They are very good. They, they, I would say all of them could really start a modeling career. Coming up, the rest of the girls get ready for their photo shoot in the center of Paris. What I ask is the most difficult part for models, it's to walk. The girl who impresses Gilles Marie will be saved from elimination and secure a seat on next week's flight to Sydney. You gotta know how to move. You gotta know how to move a suit and then be conscious of everyone you're with. I felt sorry for Becky because she had like guys whistling at her and stuff. Someone whistled, I was like, don't laugh, just keep going, just keep going. I was like, ah. Cool, 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 very cool. French photographer Gilles Marie Zimmerman captured the essence of French glamour in an intimate shoot with four of the girls in a Parisian cafe. The next four have a more difficult location to work with. The Place Vendôme is one of the most sophisticated Parisian squares, home to the Ritz Hotel and top designer boutiques. I used to be painfully shy as a child. My best friend used to say everything for me, like adults would ask me a question and she'd have to answer yes or no. It can go in two ways. It can be something that is, oh my gosh, here I am modeling on the street, which I've never done. Or it can be like, this is my moment. How do you make a suit look beautiful? How do you make a suit look sexy? How do you make a suit look feminine? I choose the four tallest girls to do this uh, thing because I, what I ask is the most difficult part for models, it's to walk. It gives immediately the style of the girls. All right, go ahead. Very good, you, 
you're still going again. So it's just like like a rush of happiness and adrenaline and just got you going. Oh my god, it, just, it was fantastic. You can't really describe it that well. Again, once more. I love the suit. I think it's very chic. <laughs> it's sort of the masculine, but then the hair is really curly and the makeup's real smoky eyes. I love, and it's sort of feminine. And yeah, no, I really, really like the whole thing going on. <laughs> I feel like a model now. 16-year-old <laughs> Ellen has no problem fighting off the distractions. She is loving this shoot. Everyone just sort of started crowding around like a street performance sort of thing. I didn't know what to think, but I just like tried to not make it um, put me off and just kept going. <laughs> The Parisians are used to fashion shoots on their streets. Women shout advice and men whistle. But the rookie models must carry on and stay focused throughout. I felt sorry for Becky because she had like guys whistling at her and stuff. It was funny. Keep going. Don't. There was loads of people standing there. I was like, and then like someone whistled. I was like, don't laugh, just keep going, just keep going. I was like, ah. Big step, yes. Very cool, Becky. Thank you. It was so much fun. I want to do it again. I love what I'm wearing. Makeup and the hair is, I love it. Like, I could never do it myself. I adore it. Yes. Happiness in the face. Open your face. Great. Super. I didn't really mind spectators watching. I just sort of thought that ah, happens. I thought it went really well, actually. Let's do one and in the pocket, yes. Okay, go. Great. Good work, you know? <laughs> I had to keep my eyes open. They kept water and you just got to sore as well. That's kind of difficult, keeping my eyes open when they're streaming with tears. Done. Jenny has asked Gilles Marie to select one girl that most impressed him at the shoots, and that girl will be saved from elimination tomorrow. After I, I saw the pictures, uh, I changed a little bit my mind about who I prefer. The favorite one of the first group is uh, Ashling. She's got this great charm and this very beautiful, cute little face, very nice for beauty shots. And for the second group, I pick up Lucy, she has a very good style walking, which is very difficult. But the thing is, between those two now, I have to make my mind.